How is Starfield so far? I really enjoy it. You guys want to see my ship? Look at this. Behold. This is the golden crab. I'll let you guys get a good look at it. Hang on. Need some work done? Sure. How about it? Look, the golden crab. It's a fine ship. It looks kind of like an, a, like an attack helicopter from the front. It actually kind of does. Now that I'm thinking about it, it looks like a weird gunship from the front of it. I mean, it's kind of crab-like, right? It's kind of crab-like. Oh goodness, so many gifted subscriptions, you must really hate money. Oh my god, five gifted subscriptions from the Scarlet King! Thank you so much, Scarlet King! What happened to Treasure Panda? That is on my other character. Which, unfortunately, it, something happened with the other one, so I'm, I'm not playing that one. Thank you very much, dude! Um, also, completely unrelated... Hang on, let me... Can I... So I saw this ship earlier. If I can bring this image up. I saw this ship earlier. And I, I want to try and build it or find out where the hell to get it. I don't know where the hell to get this ship from. It's really cool. It, it is oh, basically the so milk crate ship. Holy shit! You must really hate money. Ten gifted subscriptions from the uh, from Lord Xander two one two. Thank you very much, Lord Xander. But yeah, I want to get this ship. I really appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. I really want to get this ship. I just don't know where to get this ship from. It's really cool, though. Thank you very much, dude. I really appreciate it. Well, happy birthday, Sage the Gage. It is the you know if if I can find this ship it will be it will be named the SS Milk Crate. We will name this ship the SS Milk Crate if I can find it. I promise that is what we will name it. Mod you found for Skyrim that replaces the main menu background with a Dovahkin raccoon. That's kind of fun. I've tried to build this ship a couple times. I don't. I can't build it though. I don't know how to. But I I want I want this. Tell me where to find this ship. I'm assuming... I'm assuming that it's in... Free Star Collective space, but I'm not positive. Oh goodness, so many gifted subscriptions. You oh my god, really five more money. gifted subscriptions from Doofus16! Thank you so much, man! Guys, why are you gifting me so many subscriptions? I'm not even playing the game yet, I'm staring at menus. Anything I can help you with? There's so many gifted subs. I really appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. Okay, no problem. Um, we got this thing. This is a piece of crap that we found earlier. That was gonna rip it apart and use it to build a new ship. Let's see. What what can what can what can we do here? I'm gonna have to reset that sub counter. I am gonna have to reset it soon. You're right. What is the warning on this? Oh, reduce mass. Oh goodness, so many gifted subscriptions. Oh my you god! Really Holy shit, dude! Twenty gifted subscriptions from Lord Xander. Oh my god, man. Oh goodness, so many gifted subscriptions. You must really hate money. 
and three gifted subscriptions from Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. Thank you so much, guys. Jesus Christ, I thank you so much, guys. What 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 am I gonna do now? I I we reached the sub goal. What are we gonna do? I don't I don't know what to do now that we've reached the sub goal. What does the H O ninety two F mean? Um, that's a that's like a weird error code that shows up in the anime Rujin Z. 24 hour street good god no i can't do that what was the goal for anyway just to get to the 30 sub goal 30 subs what does my inner raccoon tell me to do i don't have the strength for a 24 hour stream god that that would that would be exhausting um let's Stream's over, goal was to end the night. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. We're not gonna end the stream now. Oh god, Uncle Larry? <sighs> Man, I don't know if I'm I don't know if I'm ready for Uncle Larry to show up. He's, he's a gifted special. subscription. How generous! Thank you very much for two more gifted subscriptions, the Scarlet King. Is this going to be another shipbuilding stream? Not entirely. I I want to see if I can make that ship. I just I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Ah, eh, whatever. Yeah, I we we shouldn't. I shouldn't. You guys have gifted so many subs. I should actually play the game and not play around with uh, with making ships for an extended period of time. We should actually go do stuff. Oh, I should show you guys the inside of my ship. We'll do that here. I'll show you guys the inside of my ship. Alright, so here we have the cockpit. I really like this because the inside of this cockpit looks like a hind D. It's great. Got those two little jump seats there. We've got the captain's locker, which has toilet paper and ship repair fundamentals. Because those are the two most important things you can have in a spaceship. I did say pit, you're right. And then just here we've got various different supplies that we might need. Uh, there's some radioactive components. I don't know why they're, those are there. Did I get a Doring fan? No, this character is basically the same as my previous character. Um, how do I how do I view how do I view just me? I forget what that is. Oh, I have an affliction. What? When did I get an affliction? Um, long hauler, neon street rat, and wanted. I, I picked long hauler instead of uh, street rat and wanted. I don't remember getting an affliction at any point, but it doesn't actually show up. So, all right, whatever. That that's weird. Thank you very much for the bits, corrupt, corrupt wanderer. And then down in here, we've got a bunk. These pillows are. What is going on with these pillows? Will be. There you go, Wilby. Alright, there we go. And then we've got over here the plushy Xeno Snuggle. Why is this Terra Brew cup on the floor? Get rid of it. Uh, no, I switched to Space Trucker because I'm really more of a Space Trucker than a Space Scoundrel. Also, who is leaving those beer bottles? I did not put those beer bottles down there. This ship needs to be freaking cleaned up. Here's the bathroom. There shouldn't be a food tray in the bathroom. Who? 
Whoever I got this ship from left a food tray in the bathroom, and that's disgusting. Alright, anyway, moving on. Here we have the, the kitchen. Thank you for the bits, Scarlet King. You booked an appointment at the bank to take out a loan to get more subs. Guys, don't go in debt to give me subs. No adoring fan? No, no, no adoring fan this time. So here's all the different dishes. Uh, that turkey needs to be in the fridge. I don't know why the hell it isn't. Caffeine. Here's the fridge. See? Wonderful. And uh, here is the like little living area. I don't know why there's a bunch of weights down there because I don't lift weights. Throw that away. What the? Come on, get out of there. Wait. Get out. Wait. There we go. We got we got it out of there. Todd! <laughs> I'm I'm you know, I'm gonna be completely honest. I'm amazed that shaking it actually made the weight drop out of the thing. Good old Bethesda physics. You know what would be kind of funny? I know there's not like a strength stat in this game, but it would be kind of funny if you tried to pick those up and it was like, your strength is not high enough. God, this place needs to be cleaned up. Look at this mess. Alright. Let's go actually do something, huh? How's the stream looking? Is it looking smooth? Do I need to lower the graphic settings? Do I have a companion? I do not have a companion. <laughs> Thank you for the 1,500 bits, Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. Holy shit, man. Wish your house wasn't on fire right now. For real, for real. Away we go. Do I not have that one lady companion? No, I got... I, I sent her back home. Not even Bosco. I do not have Bosco with me. Alright, we are going to go to my outpost really quick. Stream looks sex... Also, this game it looks too good to run on my PC. That is entirely possible. It it does have some pretty high requirements. And thank you much, very much, or thank you very much for the bits, corrupt wanderer. All right, let's see. Everything is still laying out here in the open where I left it. those. We'll take the sealant. Choo -choo. Oh, hello, Treasure Panda. Choo -choo. Choo -choo 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 it's choo -choo. it's all out in the open because I didn't want to carry it. Choo -choo. I I know that makes you grumpy, but I just straight up didn't want to look how much this stuff weighs. Choo -choo 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 -choo. Choo -choo -choo -choo. I'm not getting rid of guns to carry more crap that I'm not gonna use, TP. Choo -choo. I don't understand the crafting in this game. I don't like doing it. It doesn't make me happy. See, look, I'm already encumbered. Did you, you? You have another subscriber. Thank you very much for the subscription. Nine to five, one, two, three. Did you? TP's been hanging out with other raccoons in Fallout 4 and Skyrim. Did you? What do you mean it's true? Did you? Look at look at all this junk. Do, do, do. TP D, T, Treasure Panda 100% has all of the carry weight enhancement perks. Do, do.
I just like I don't want to. Man, I just don't want to do crafting. I really don't. It doesn't appeal to me. All right, back to my ship. Choo -choo -choo. Treasure Panda's carry capacity is just yes. <laughs> Are there alien babes in this game? I don't think there are. That is kind of a bummer, isn't it, TP? No, if you do that, it... Okay. See, now you're, now you're building up CO2. Nice glasses. He says thank you. I don't know why it didn't notify me about that bit donation. Just want to be a normal space guy doing space, doing normal things. Same. That's why I like haven't been doing any that settlement back there, which isn't really even a settlement. It's literally one room and some storage containers, and I refuse to use it. That's that's all. I, that's all I've done in terms of like base building. I hate base building. I don't want to do it. It doesn't interest me game needs the option to hire an NPC to do all the gathering crafting for you. Yeah, I agree with that. You love the rainbow aviator glasses? They're pit vipers! It could be a storage depot. It's a settlement for your stuff. The thing I don't like about it is that you build these containers for items, and they they have a limited storage capacity, which drives me nuts. See, look at that. Most at 500 out of 6... Oh my god. Alright, we're gonna have to sell some crap. Like, that's too much... That's too much junk. Choo -choo. If you're gonna craft, why not sell the stuff in the boxes? That's what I'm gonna do. loud and am I too quiet? I'm just wondering. It might that might be the case. I feel like maybe the game's a little too loud. We'll turn it down just a little bit. Alright. Game's only loud when the ship takes off? Okay, well I turned it down just a little bit. So we're gonna go to I guess we'll go back here. Oops, I went to the wrong area. Thank you so much, Corrupt Wanderer, you for the 1,000 bits. Brother. I really appreciate it, man. I'm, I'm glad that you like watching our videos so much. And thank you very much, Ogre Evans, for the Prime subscription. Choo-choo-choo! Choo-choo! Choo-choo-choo! I went to the wrong spot, TP. Choo-choo! I meant to go to uh, New Atlantis. Did you? What's my favorite quest so far? Um, I really like the one to get the tools for the miners on Mars. That was really fun. You asked Mike his opinion on you driving to Nevada to buy a $3,500 cat. He told you that the, the cat better wash your car and do your taxes. What are my thoughts? Better be a really nice cat. Hey, what can I do for you? All right, TP. I know that this goes against your nature. Choo -choo. He's angry. You can't tell because he's got the pit vipers on. I know that this goes against your nature of not wanting to sell things, but we're going to sell a bunch of resources Choo -choo. so that we can buy more things. We can buy treasure for you. Ooh, choo -choo. Choo -choo. Yes, exactly. We're doing this to get you treasures. Choo. Like, 
Like, we don't need 25 chlorine. And 11 cobalt. We don't need that. We can have, we can have one cobalt. And... Six copper. Choo-choo. What CPU, GPU do I have? You can find the answer to that question in the Frequently Asked Questions. Choo-choo. But, like, this gold is... Heavy. So, sell it. Choo-choo. Keep the iron, sell the... L uh, no, keep the lead because I think I need that for weapon crafting. Uh, sell. Sell. Oh, no. There we go. Look how much... Yeah, we can sell almost all that nickel except for like 10. There. Choo choo choo. Thank you, thank you very much for stopping by, Scarlet King. I really appreciate all of the subs. Thank you so much, man. Did you? Do did you? All right, we should go compete a. Compete. We should go do this mission that I was doing. Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? Oh, TP. Did you just turn on the mode only chat? Did you? All right. We are going to go to... Oops, wrong way. Well, we're going to have to go here. Oh, no, we have to go to here. We got to go to Lopez's farm. Which I really think his farm is more of a mine than a farm. But I could be wrong. Choo. Choo choo. And there he goes. He has vanished. Oh, see, that's way better. That's a that's way better. Stupid. Sources weighing my ship down. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Toilet paper. Yep. Man, look at all this random junk I got. Oh, I forgot to sell this junk when I was back there. Crap. I can't believe I forgot to sell that junk. Bathroom must always be stocked with toilet paper. You never know when you'll need to take a space poo. You must have toilet paper for such an occasion. That's why I also keep one spare roll of toilet paper inside my ship. Or inside the, the captain's locker. Alright. Lopez's farm. And before we before we go to Lopez's farm, we are going to 
Make sure that we get weapons set up. Got Nova Light. Ah, here we go. Perfect. Yeah, you know what? We'll put that one here and that one here. This is like too many guns I'm carrying right now, but whatever. It's on brand, I guess. Oh. Ooh. Bethesda bugs. Hi, Bethesda bug. That's silly. Is it dropping down? Oh, well. All right, well, we'll ignore that. Ooh. Ooh! Yo, I can just have this? You're just gonna let me take this? I freaking love free stuff. My god. They should they should not have uh have left those unsecured. Alright. Let's Oh, he's out here. Doctor Help, I think he's in charge. Oh, alright, phone type. Oh, there we go, there he is. Hey! Hey! Jacqueline, Jacqueline, Jacqueline! Jacqueline! Jacqueline, we're twinsies! We're twinsies! That wasn't on purpose, I swear. I swear that wasn't on purpose, but look, we're twins! All right, fine. Don't talk to me. I don't care. This has some look, neat looking armor, though. Glad to hear you're back. Safe and uh, sound. Ooh. Banda, you owe me 30 credits. You're tougher than I thought. Easy money. So while you were doing that, I used the communication satellites to triangulate some spacer's chatter. You did what? I'm more than just a pretty face. Anyway, there's an old derelict star station the spacers are using as a base. Ooh, guys, we're gonna go shoot spacers. I mean, there's a real outside chance there's a relay or something there, but these spacers aren't the most savvy of customers. I'm telling you, that's where they're holed up. Okay, then. Well, let's go. Couldn't say it better myself. There are undoubtedly a Thank lot you for stopping by, Doofus. There. Both really appreciate it. On the station itself. We need to excise this cancer from our system. And thank you, Pasta of the Mongolian Empire, for the uh, gifted subscription. Agree. So, oh glorious leader, any words of wisdom or inspiration before we embark? Um. <laughs> I love some of these. I love some of these options. Hey, man, I'm just a hired gun. If you want a speech, that's extra. do-overs on this one we'll all be waiting for you to jump in all right yep all right let's go don't know why that door is floating up there but don't worry about it okay good that's all there think that's where we need to go.
Are one of them named Spacer Raccoons? Yes. Unfortunately, the ship is not actually that good. I wish the Spacer Raccoon was better, but it's not a very good ship. I'm sorry. That's all of them. Ooh, oh boy. Nope, that's not all of them. Ow. One down. Good to goodness, he was right there. Hey, that's all of them. I don't want either of those. We're just going to go ahead and board the station and not really worry about scavenging. I want there to be an easter egg of you landing on a random moon to find a bald guy and his dog looking for cheese. That'd be kind of funny. Well, uh, no. I mean, I do like spending time with Cass. Interestingly, there's two there's two sassy redheads with southern accents in this game. Both of whom do stuff with guns, which is odd. If I had a nickel for every time I found a sassy redhead in this game who worked with guns and had a southern accent, I'd have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it's happened twice. Oh, I guess she doesn't. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. Oh, man. We're going to miss the fighting.
guys are you guys are kind of in my way. Um, on Aquila City, there's the the lady that owns the gun store. Hey, oh wait, there's one more. Right. Is that all of them, or am I gonna have to? Do, do I have to clear out more of this? I kind of hope there's more I have to clear out. This is how I get money by selling gun stuff. By the rip shot, I guess not. Do a little bit more. Ooh, a little bit more looting. Nope. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, I don't think so. No, I don't want that. Game trying to give me resources. Like I'm actually going to use resources. Nova Light. Ooh. Also, there's vents you can go in in this game. What do you think this is a crafting? I know! I hate crafting in video games, and I don't know why they're so insistent on going all in on it. Oh, I gotta go to the next level. Okay. We will momentarily. No, uh, no, I didn't. I did not vent. Weird. I don't know why I started playing like a ship landing noise, but that's fine. One of the things that I, I will say that I do not like about this game is that when you remove attachments from guns, that attachment is gone. You cannot take attach- you cannot find a gun with a really good attachment, remove the attachment, and put it on a gun that you currently have. Which is really annoying. This gun rips, though. Revolver, you do the revolvers in this game are real good. Oh, that goes, okay. So that just goes to another level. I should look at what that note says so that I can just discard it on the ground. What does it shoot, 500? No, this revolver, so this one, this is the mag shot. Any of the, I think they're called like something, it's like blank shot weapons. And they're all based off of, at least I'm pretty sure, all of these are based off of uh, something from the early 2000s that was called Metal Storm. And what Metal Storm was, was like this. Um, 
It was an electronic... All the bullets were stacked on top of each other, and they were electronically fired. So basically, the barrel of the gun was the magazine. Um, it was a really interesting concept. It was one of these things that sometimes... I still see him floating around occasionally, uh, videos on YouTube that's like, one million bullets per second, and it's, it basically just looks like a box with a bunch of tubes in it. Um, and like I said, it was a really interesting concept, it just didn't work out in practice. And I'm pretty sure that all of the, like, quote-unquote shot, like maggot shot, or whatever they're, they're called, I'm pretty sure all of those guns are based off of Metal Storm. I could be wrong, though. Um, yeah, Metal Storm, it was a really interesting idea. It didn't really go anywhere. It was kind of just a dead end in term of, in terms of, uh, Calling all spacers. in terms of, like, yeah, firearms development, are. but it was really interesting. Because that's what they call us, isn't it? The ones in charge. The ones who never respected us. The Free Star Collective. The United Oh, okay. Colonies. Yeah, I don't need to, I don't need to listen to that. It's basically just like, hey, spacers, go to all these abandoned buildings and take them over. That's gonna be ours. Oh, I didn't. We always knew there oh, well. Were some left well, over from gonna keep going. Bases, labs, stuff like that. But now it's come out that there are even more. A lot more. Spread all over the settled system. Oh, yeah, the, the superposed load guns. Yep, that's what they were called. Now it's a friggin' feeding friend. Everyone trying to find them. Trying to use them. So why shouldn't we? We have just as much right as they do. Okay, you can you can stop talking now, lady. I'm in the middle of a firefight. Yeah, this gun absolutely slaps though. Shotgun. Are there any laser guns in this game? Indeed there are. That caught me off guard. I should have uh, been paying attention and not trying to loot. That guy's chunky. Shit. That kind of bums me out that that didn't uh, that didn't go through there. Here, we'll use the Nova Light because that's a that's kind of a laser gun. Nova Light also kind of rips. Thank you very much for the two gifted subscriptions, Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. Come get me. You jerk. I wonder if he'll actually try to come get me. That'd be nice. Ooh. Ooh. Have to get those open. Oh, oh shit! Does it actually go somewhere? Oh my god, I can vent. You guys, you guys, I can vent. Whoa. Okay, I found a weird gun. I found another weird gun. I found two weird guns. All right, hang on, I'm gonna vent real quick. BRB. So that just kind of comes out right back here. Wow, so that didn't really go anywhere. Come on, dude. You gotta you gotta come to me, man. What was that weapon I just found? Uh 
Um, that's weird. I don't hate it, but it's weird looking. Also, I found this. I did find one of these earlier. They're pretty good. This is, oh yeah, this is another laser gun. Here you go, laser gun. We'll see if this guy steps on the landmine first. He stepped on one. All right, here we'll we'll shoot him with this thing. We'll finish him off with this little PDW that I built. I like personal defense weapons. Right. Man, so much stuff. The captain's computer. I do like my pocket Burt guns. Keep the key in this room at all times. Okay, so the key is in this room somewhere. Thank you very much, Potato Doge. 420. They put in the cute alien animals in Starfield. Uh, they put little cute alien plushies. I can show you when I get back to my ship. Remind me when I get back to my ship and I will show you the cute alien plushie. Jeez, look at all this money. Man, that was a lot of money. Thank you very much, Corrupt Wanderer, for the 100 bits. I really appreciate it, man. All right. Go back and talk to what's-his-name. I'm a little disappointed I didn't use the uh, the PDW more during that, that gunfight. This thing's really good. I should have used it more often. It's a, um, it's a flechette gun. According to the game, anyway. I wish my flashlight did a little bit more. It's kind of weak, to be completely honest. Beep boop. Ooh, beep boop. Beep boop. Beep boop. These look like relatively cozy small rooms. Choo choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. Choo choo. You know, Treasure Panda, right now we're supposed to be going back and talking to a guy, but you know what we're doing instead? Choo choo. We're looting. Choo! He gets very excited about looting. Choo -choo! Choo. Choo -choo -choo -choo. Choo -choo 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 -choo. You know, you don't have to take every single my friend will be you find treasure panda. All right, fine. I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you that you're not allowed to. I'm just saying you don't have to. Did you? All right. 
right, that's probably decent. How much weight are we at right now? Uh, we can carry a little bit more. Ooh, no, we don't have time to work on our spacesuit right now, TP. Like, we, we don't have time right now, TP. Besides, we don't even have the mods for it. I can't, I can't even do it yet. Because I don't have spacesuit mods. I know you want the drip, but we, we, we just don't, we don't have time right at the second. Ooh, did you? I, you know, I left that there before because I didn't think I would need it. Did you? Did you? This, this is the first deep breath I've taken in months. Choo -choo. You, you did this, and now it's up to us to keep it going. I mean, you know, that was a that was a team effort, I guess. Yay, go team! Yeah. Very diplomatic. It's horseshit, of course. Yeah, it was. But it sounded nice. Great. The rest of the families and I, well, we chipped in for a reward. Ooh, choo choo. It's probably a pittance compared to what someone like you makes. Dude, I don't make anything. I'm a hobo. Just dirt poor farmers and miners just trying to get by. I think I need to shut up now. One, two, three. I mean, hey, man, you better be careful. I'll tell everyone you're a softy. Don't you dare. I have my precious reputation to maintain. If you ever you? are in this system, you come back and visit. We'll give you a warm welcome for the ages. Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? It would be nice to be safe again. Did you? Did, did you? So what did, did I? What did I get from that? I got. I mean, I got money, obviously. Oh, and I leveled. That's right. I leveled a little while ago. Did you? I do no. I still gotta kill a lot more people with ballistic weapons. Uh, no, I'm still gonna do that. I guess I could pick payloads. That might not be a bad option. You too. Carry more stuff. Um. Do ballistic weapons do more damage? We could do. Lock on to enemy ships is slower. You can also do rank two of persuasion. That might not be a bad idea. Did you? Strong bat, yeah. Maybe increase my carrying capacity. That's not a bad idea. Do, do, do. Like that's always a good idea, just to pick more carrying capacity. Do, do, do. Do, do. Well, thank you for stopping by once again, TP. Could increase range of grav jump drives. That would actually make sense for a space trucker. Or I could get the ability to pilot Class B ships. That might be a really good idea. Is there a perk that would help with something I'm lacking? Payloads would be a good idea just for more uh, for more ship capacity. Class B might be the way to... Yeah, Class B might be really good because then I can get bigger generators for my ships. Or bigger reactors. I think weightlifting or... Eh, you know what? Yeah, we'll just, we'll just go with Class B ships. I want that. Space Trucker! Now I can pilot Class B ships. Oh, wait. I didn't tell me I can go to the deserted relay station. What is my current objective, anyway? D 
do we know what class the milk crate is? I do not know what class the milk crate is. Um, I don't think it's a class C. It doesn't look big enough to be a class C ship. So right now I can pilot class A and class B ships. Class C is the last, uh, the last one, and I cannot pilot those just yet. Um, the milk crate. Yeah. So I found a ship earlier. Um. Oh, he's fun! Oh my god, that was adorable. I found a ship earlier. Um, I have not found it in the game. Some, one of the characters had it. I don't know where it is. Um, I'm hoping that I can... Plushie, yes indeed, plushie. Oh jeez, I'm so I'm sorry, Taki, that you accidentally sorry you accidentally deleted your save, man. That fucking sucks. I lost when I was playing earlier, I lost uh, an hour of gameplay because the game uh decided that I didn't have any repair parts on my ship. So I couldn't survive a uh shipborne com uh, combat section. All right, we need to put this plushie somewhere. Where are we going to put him? I think we're going to put him on this little desk. Oh. Pooch, or plushie parsec pooch. Oh, he's adorable. Here, we'll put him on the couch. There you go, plushy parsec pooch. He is he is absolutely adorable. How did I rotate him? Um if you're playing on oop. Whoops. If you're playing on PC. If you're playing on PC, you pick it up and you click the left and right buttons to, or the left and right mouse buttons to ro or to rotate and then to pivot or to change what axis, axis, axes he is on, you press shift. I think you press center stick on uh, Xbox controller to, ch to change what axis it rotates on. I want one of these. I think the plushy Xeno Snuggle is adorable. Alright. Pilot seat. All right. Oh my goodness, look at all these different things that are floating around in here. Wow, a lot of stuff blew up. Oh, you know what? We're not going to be fighting anything for a minute, so we can... Can't see how Brian would be an homage to Snoopy. He's a white dog. I mean, yeah, they're both white. They're, yes, they're both white beagles. Did I upgrade my graphics? I did. I got a um, I got a uh, AMD graphics card. You know what? I I don't want to I don't want to scavenge all of these. That's gonna be too much of a pain. I don't feel like doing that. All right, we need to go to here. And we
we need to go to here. Go ship hunting to try to find the milk crate. I don't know where to go to, though. That's the only problem. I, I really have no idea where to even start looking to find the SS milk crate. I, my guess is it'll be in free or it'll be in free star collective space, but I don't know. Have I experienced much stuttering? No, I haven't really experienced any stuttering. Plenty of havoc if left on Okay, no problem. Wait, why did I do view and modify my ships? I didn't want to do that. I want to see what ships I'm you have. Sure, you can find something you like. All right, so it's close, but it's not it. That's cool looking. I like that. Hey, that's the ship mine's based off of. I sold those two to him. Alright, we're gonna go sell crap. We're not taking the gun out. We're gonna go sell crap. Alright, uh... A gifted subscription. How generous. Thank you very much for the gifted subscription. Anakin Skywalker. That's concerning. All my game modding wisdom, Fallout 4 keeps crashing with mods. You know what it could be? It's just the fact that it's Fallout 4. I, I really can't tell you anything beyond it's Fallout 4. Fallout 4 is so unstable. Right up front, and if you're short on credits, I can't help you. No more charity cases. I'll go out of business. I want to do your business quick. The Rangers plan on dropping by for an order soon. You've been telling me that since I first showed up here. Do you have the gun that I want yet? Nobody has the freaking gun I want. Whoa! Oh look, another resubscriber. Well, we'll need that. Thank you very much, Punk Raider, for the nine-month subscription. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I need this. We can sell that. We can sell this. Do not sell that. Do I have... Okay, I have plenty of ammo for that. Sell this. And sell this. Sell this. Does anyone remember the name of his actual ship? Um, here, I can show you I can show you what it looks like. I I don't know what the name of the ship is. Give me just a second and I can show you what it looked like. There you go. Thank you very much, Pasta of the Mongolian Empire, for the 1,500 bits. Oh my god, dude. Thank you so much, man. Why did you accidentally throw your PC into oncoming traffic? Don't do that. Um, That's what the ship looks like. I, I don't know where to buy this ship. If anyone knows... Where that ship is, please tell me. Because uh, I have no idea where to buy it. Based on the parts that are in it, I'm pretty sure it's in Freestar Collective Space. What's the ship called? No idea. I have no idea what it's called. It was um, some different characters, some, some random character's ship. Uh, I have no idea what the ship was called.
but I really want that ship. I have no idea where to get it from. Um, if anyone knows, please tell me. Space Trucker Flannel! Try Hope Town? I don't know where that is. You don't have to tell me, it's fine. I just, I, I've never been there. Oh yeah, I probably should read these. Well, I've read that one, I've read that one. I should read those two. Grunt! Ooh, this is a long book. Hmm. Neat. Alright. We'll just go ahead and sell those. Take a look around. You're good. How about I just show you instead of tell you? And then I got miscellaneous stuff to sell him. Gotta dip for a bit. That's fine. Contemporary cigarettes. Lovely. And I'm actually uh, relatively low carry weight right now, which is great. Go visit the redheaded gun lady. Wait, first we're going to do this. Well, oh, we can get a long barrel. Laser. That looks weird with the reflex sight on there. Choke. Can you put a stock on it? I. You cannot put a stock on this gun, which is strange. It's like a pistol shotgun. It's kind of like a Mag 7, actually. Which is a little weird. I'm interested to try that. Have I found any old old earth weapons? Yeah, I found a few so far. They're on my ship. I don't really use them at all. You ask me, I don't do payment plans or lines of credit, and I don't sell to shady individuals. If you can handle that, your money's welcome here. Shame on that. Here's my selection. Uh, lady, I've come in here and bought guns from you like six times now. What do you mean I seem all right? Acting like you've never talked to me before. Ooh! I'm gonna have to buy that. We'll we'll think about that. Is that a VSS? Yes, it was. There's some what they're called old earth guns. All right. So one of the things that I want to complain about about the old earth pistol. This really annoys me about this gun. If I can get it in a good spot, right here. And here, there's these two holes. That is a housing to hold the spring that pushes on the. There's a spring in here with two detents. One detent pushes on the safety. The other one pushes on the slide stop. The fact that that housing is completely missing drives me absolutely insane. Yes, the gun would still function, but it wouldn't function great. Also, this cut is a little bit too... It needs to be further back. I find it really weird that they incorporated features from a 1911 and a 1911 A1 on this. Like, the hammer is from an A1. The safety is from a 1911. Not the A1. That's like a, that's a, the old original 1911 safety. This is, like I said, not cut down far enough. I don't know what the point of that hole right there is. That shouldn't be there. there there's no purpose for that being there. 
It also goes all the way through onto the other side of the frame, which is weird. There's supposed to be a screw that goes in there. That is completely missing. I don't know why that's not in there. I mean, like, they did a good job making this mod, honestly. Or, mod. They did a good job making this gun. But it's missing quite a few components. Also, this grip panel doesn't go up far enough. It should be going up to, like, right there. Anyway. I have a couple problems with the old Earth pistol in this game. Also, why is the frame so square? Uh, whatever. Hmm. Do I buy this? Eh, we'll think about it. Yeah, see, I have the old Earth pistol, I have the old Earth shotgun. Thank you very much for the gifted sub pasta of the Mongolian Empire. I really appreciate it. God damn, we are at 60 subs. Holy shit. Thank you, guys. I can't believe how many subs we got tonight. Thank you so much, you guys. The old Earth shotgun hurts your brain. It's like all the shotguns, like all the guns in this game, it's a combination of a bunch of different things. So this, this lug right here and the magazine end cap are straight from an Ithaca 37. The heat shield on the top of it and front and rear, or the heat shield on the top of it is from a Mossberg 500. So is the bolt. The bolt is from a Mossberg 500, but then it's got this... screw with a second screw that holds it in place that is from uh the ithaca 37 safety is from a mossberg 500 pump is the pump is kind of like a remington modular combat system shotgun this bayonet lug that goes on right here because that's what that is that is a bayonet lug that comes off the mossberg 500 and then this adjustable buckhorn rear sight is I want to say from certain Ithaca 37s. And then, yeah, this looks like an MP40 pistol grip, which is a little weird. The pump is a little bit too far back for you to actually be able to get the shotgun shells in there. But it's it's modeled after two shotguns. They basically, they basically took an Ithaca 37 and a Mossberg 500 and kind of mashed them together. And this is what they came up with. I don't think it's bad. I think it's fine. I suspect the old Earth shotgun was designed to look like Hicks shotgun from Aliens. That would be true because Hicks shotgun in the movie Aliens was an Ithaca 37. So, it's like I said, they basically took two shotguns and kind of smashed them together. So they have bits and pieces of the Mossberg 500 and the Ithaca 37. This is, like I said, MP40 grip, but it's also... This part right here reminds me of the top folding stock on Benelli shotguns. Um, but yeah, it's just a couple, couple different ones. I don't know what's going on with this handguard on the old earth hunting rifle, which is a VSS Ventores. Like I said, I don't know what's going on with that handguard. It's a little strange, not bad. It's just a little strange. I kind of like that there's tape holding the the eye cup on gifted there. Gifted subscription, how generous! Thank you very much for another gifted subscription, pasta of the Mongolian Empire. Um, I don't like that you can't take the scope off of this. I wish that you could shoot this with just iron sights. I really don't like that you can't take the scope on, off of it. Alright, let's go to the other gun store that's here and see if the revolver that I want is available. If I can remember where to go. I think it's up this way. You have a nice day now.
Okay, I don't actually remember where I'm going. What the hell is Leardo for our arms? Probably this way. You're a nice stop wouldn't be Well, maybe I will go there next. Ah! They copied the Halo guns? Yes, because Halo was the first, the first media source ever to put ammo counters on guns. Definitely wasn't done all the way back in like the 1920s with with brass ammo counters on on lever action rifles. Might want to steer clear of the stretch. Lots of crime over there. Okay, I'll think about it. Every gun hey, 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 sell me, sell me the Razorback. I want the Razorback. Give me. Chose to visit. Here's what I have in stock right now. Give me Razorback. You better have the Razorback in stock. Why do you not have just the base Razorback in stock? Oh my god. What level do I have to be to get that gun? I hate you. God damn it. I need to I need more research to be able to put the freaking choke on there. Uh man, I hate crafting in this game so much. It drives me nuts. Maybe I can maybe I can Maybe I can weasel one through the cabinet. Get a unique version of the Razorback from Yeah, but it has filigree on it and I hate filigree. Filigree does not belong on guns. That's weird that I can grab that one. Can I grab this one then? Get a free one from the Sam Co mission. It's not a shelf model only. See, look. Look, I I look, I can pick that up. See? I can pick this one up. That is not a shelf model only. Miss Lance is the one you want to speak to. Please. Let me know if I can be of service. I will let you. You can you can be of service by selling me this gun that's in the cabinet. Sell me this one that's in the... It's right there. Give me that gun. Give me. Choo-choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. Choo-choo. Treasure Panda, get me that gun. Because I want it. Give me it. I think you'll find that we carry fine weapons of all kinds here. Alright, fine. I what good what good are you then, TP? There's not enough to do around. Makes me so freaking mad I don't have that gun yet. And I can't, I, I straight up cannot find any info on when that gun unlocks. Uh, all right. Well, what are we, what are we currently doing? Do, do, do. Mm, no, no, no. No, 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 no. I mean, I guess I probably should do these things. But I kind of don't want to. Like, don't don't make me do quest stuff. I don't want to do quest stuff.
Jeez. That's... Oh, because that's, like, way down there. I forget that this is, like, in three-dimensional space. Hey, we're just gonna go here. Ooh, did you? We're already here. Ju -ju -ju. That's it? Alright, fine. We'll go to the ship. Ju -ju -ju. Ooh, ju -ju. Lots of rocks. She with console commands? Yeah, but then it disables all achievements. You. Oh. You, you, you. Yeah, I don't think anybody's alive, TP. Am I going to try to get all achievements? Maybe. I'm trying to get the Razorback gun. And I don't think it starts spawning in until I get to a higher level, so. Oh, that does stupid damage. Why does this one do so much damage? What? What the f- Uh... Literally all I did was put glow sights on it. Why does it do so much more damage than the normal one? Is that like a weird glitch that happened? Try reaching level 11. Did you? Alright, whatever. I don't understand why this one is doing 162 damage. That makes no sense to me, but... Did you? Ooh, did you? That's not good. Ooh, now that I have the captain's key, can I get into, uh, into here? No, I can't. Maintenance log. Mm. You 
have another subscriber. Thank you very much for subscribing, the Abyss Hunter. I really appreciate it. Things did not go well on this ship. That makes me kind of sad. That's a bummer. Oh, I probably should bring that with me. Yeah, we'll, we'll take that. We'll, we'll take that with me so that we can tell that person's mom that you loved her. Maybe. I won't be able to. Also, I found a new helmet. That's kind of cool looking. I mean, it, it, it sucks, but it looks cool. Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? Oh, gotta fix him. There we go. Did you? How am I enjoying the game? I really like it. Aside from the fact that I can't find this stupid revolver that I want. Did you? Why do I have 24 of these things? No wonder my weight is so... Oh my god. This is what I mean about the resource. Look at this. Look, I... Treasure Panda. Choo -choo. I know you like collecting junk. A gifted subscription. Choo -choo. How generous. Thank you very much, Pirates of the, of the Mongolian Empire. I know you like... I know you like collecting junk, Treasure Panda. Choo -choo. But this is absolutely ridiculous. And I know this isn't your fault. Not, not that. That's a that, that's a wooden duck. That's fine. Teach you. At what point did I pick up 24 of these stupid manifolds that weigh 4.3 pounds each? Jettison every single one of them. Look how much weight that just dropped. Ridiculous! Teach you. The wooden duck is very important. Do, do, do. A gifted subscription, how generous. Thank you for another gifted subscription, Pasta. I really appreciate it, man. Do, do. Well, there really is not a whole lot here on this specific planet. You know, I should have checked if I could take over that ship. No, I can't. That ship's completely disabled. Engine shields and gravity are all disabled. Talk about the Razorback, the only place to find it is Laredo Firearms. Great! Then why doesn't she ever have it? It'll make me insane. Did you? Did, did you? And there he goes. Thank you very much, Treasure Panda. Here, we're gonna head to... I don't know. What? Ooh. Interesting that that's just owned by Crimson Fleet, huh? Go to this planet. Am I going to play this game with Mike at some point? Probably. I'm going to try to. Ugh. Ooh. Hello. The heck? Huh.
You know, I've seen enough science fiction to recognize that that's some type of planetary defense system or minefield. I don't like that. Hmm. Lots of stuff on this one, though. Interesting. Well, we'll see if we explode. Yeah, that, that looks like a space minefield if I've... Yup! How did I know? <laughs> I knew it. I knew it the moment I saw it. And yet I still flew into it because I am dumb. Well, that's cool. Who puts minefields out here? What? The, there's nothing out here. Alright, what do we got here? Hello? Anyone here? Oh! Normal workers! I can't take a break right now. I'm already on thin ice with the foreman. Neat. I thought talk would never come, but here you are. Oh! A band of crimson fleets won't leave us alone. Whoops. We only keep what we needed to survive out here. And now, we don't even have that. They're not far from here. But we are not cut out for that kind of combat. Think you could take care of them? Hell yeah, I could take care of them. Thank you. Stay safe out there. Can, I, can you build bases on random planets in this game? Yes, you can. I don't want to do it, though, because it's boring and I hate it. I, I like straight up hate crafting and I don't I do not want to do it. What the heck? Oh high gravity. Well not high gravity, but Oh man, we can get all these plants scanned right now. Starfield's still fun times? Yeah, I like it. It's fun. May have these plants scanned in a jiffy. There we go. Plants scanned. Ooh! Friends!
No, 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 no. I'm, I'm friend. I am not attacking you. I'm just trying to get pictures of you. Fuck off. Go away. Like Gipper trying to make friends with animals. All right, you guys done? Oh, I think they're gonna go attack the civilians now. Whatever, that's not my problem. Oh yeah, they're probably mad about me attacking their plants. I wasn't taking pictures of their buttholes, I was taking pictures of just them in general. Don't be crude. Hey look, it's a mole rat. Maybe next time, don't just immediately attack me. What a novel concept. I don't want things. I don't want animals to attack me. I'm just trying to scan them, but my scanner sucks. That one right there looks like it's going to be 100% mean, though. That does not look French-shaped. That looks very grumpy. There we go, 100% scanned. Alright. Back to the ship. Yep, see, not friend shape. I like this gun. This gun seems very good. Is it a shotgun? Yes, it is. It is, as far as I can tell, it's in definitely inspired by the, um, it's definitely inspired by the Mag-7. Pirate activity. Defeat the Crimson Fleet Pirates at the abandoned farm. Show me on the map. You're not showing me where on the map. Oh, it's not. It's it's semi-auto. It's not fully automatic. It is semi-auto. I was just firing it real fast. See, it's only one. It's only single shot. Well, not single shot. I'm sorry. It's only semi-auto. Yeah, that's definitely inspired by a Mag 7. Oh, boy. That's going to be a long way. All right. God, no, do not poison me. All right, we've already scanned those. How far away is this? I wish it would tell me how far away that is, but that's fine. We're going to add the shotgun to my favorites before I forget, because so far I really like it. Is that 72 damage? Uh, 
favorite? Why not? We'll put it next to the other shotguns. So sad that all my uh, data... All that work for days is gone. I'm really sorry about that, man. That, that really sucks. Had, um... So there was this game that came out in the early 2000s that was called uh, Indigo Prophecy. I think, in, I think in basically every other country it was called Fahrenheit, but in the United States it was called Indigo Prophecy. Anyway, this game was alright. It was, uh, I think it was written by the same guy that wrote um, Heavy Rain. Uh, anyway. I played... Man, I played that game. I played so much of that game. I got really far into it. I don't like the end of that game. I think the end is pretty fucking weak. I really do feel like he... I really feel like his dog ate the script when he was almost done with it. So that he had to make up the end of the... He had to just, like, make up the end of it out, out of nowhere. Anyway, whatever. It doesn't matter. I was in the last, let's say, hour of the game. And... My data got corrupted. So the the entire game, and this is this is like this is you know early two thousands. So you can't really like look it up online. Um, all of it, all of it was gone. So I had to basically start the entire game over again. I, I was I was not happy about that. It made me uh, made me kind of grumpy. Gonna be, gonna be honest. Kind of grumpy is a little bit of an understatement, but whatever. Place looks neat. I think this is where I'm supposed to be going. It is. This is where I'm supposed to be going. I'm also kind of surprised how many people know what Indigo Prophecy is, to be completely honest. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, I think I like this gun. Oh, you're you're strong. You're strong. Oh my god. Oh crap! Wrong weapon. Hey, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I like this gun. This gun good. This gun's fun. This gun, this gun tickles my, my inner, uh, I have no brain, I have no aim, look at me go, I'm a shotgun main. Anti-personnel Tonto, huh? Ooh, sushi! Alright, let's, let's, let's try to loot in here real quick. Uh, no, we don't, we really don't have time to loot. We don't have time to loot! My inner raccoon is showing. We don't have time to loot. I must kill. I don't know where I am. I don't know how I got here. All I know is that I must kill. What is that? What is that thing? Oh my god, it's a Tesla Model S. Fuck you, Elon! Oh my god. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, wow. Ah! Get out of here. Did this jump into the pit of acid? Oh my god, oh my god. Yeah, that's right, your fucking robot doesn't work, Tesla. Lots of dust. Oh 
man, we are getting we are getting like lost here. Master Lock. Who locked that behind a master? Oh boy. Hide behind the plants. Oh boy. God, d are you seriously hiding behind that lamppost and it's actually working for you? All right, fine. Fine, 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 fine. I don't care. See if I care. See if I care. I don't care. The frag grenade cares though. Oh my god, they put landmines out here! Man, that was that that did not work well for me. None of none of that worked well for me. Wheat! Might be everybody. Oh shit, that isn't everybody. No, they really aren't. Also, you brought a knife to a gunfight, idiot. That might actually be everybody now. All right then. You know that could have gone better. Could have gone a. Uh, could have gone a whole lot worse. Can NPCs surrender? You know that's an excellent question. I haven't checked. I wonder if they can surrender, but it's like surrendering in Skyrim, where they go, "I surrender, I yield, I yield," and then if you let them live, they just immediately try to kill you. Rap. Choo choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. All right, we do this one. Choo choo. And this one. Choo choo. And then. I think we'll have to do that. Choo -choo. Choo -choo. Look at that. Excellent lock picking. How do I feel about shotguns in Call of Duty? Uh, basically, I can think of... No, actually, I can't think of a single game that gets shotguns right off the top of my head. Yeah, I, I can't think of a single game off the top of my head that gets shotguns right. They basically, like, con everyone consistently gets shotguns wrong. And it's always for balancing issues. Tarkov does them decently. Well, Tarkov is a garbage game and nobody plays it, so... Oh my god! Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Alright, and there's still some more buildings I gotta check out. Did you? 
Well, that was uncalled for, Treasure Panda. GTG. Chunks Potato. You know, I would not be surprised if Uncle Larry plays Tarkov. GQ. He does? I said, not surprised. See, now I have to make a chuff choice. Do I keep carrying the Pacifier, which is a pretty good shotgun? It just doesn't have the fastest firing rate. It's also pump forward, which is really strange, but whatever. That's, we're glossing over it. GTU. Or do I use the shoddy? Because holy god, that fire rate. Also, it just looks cool. I mean, I can just carry both of them, honestly. It's not like there's anything restricting me to only carrying one shotgun. Do they use the same ammo? Actually, I don't think they do. I think they use two different ammo. GTU. Um, oh, look at that! We got a Weeb Sword! Woo! Weeb Sword! GTU. Um, I don't think they use the same ammo. Shoddy uses Caseless Shell, and the Pacifier uses 15 by 25 CLL. 80, 84 versus 72. Alright. Calibrating side star. Oh! Why haven't I been using this one? Oh, it's because it doesn't have a red dot sight. Alright, well, we'll favorite that over this one. Choo choo. Choo choo choo. Ooh. Osmium Dagger? What in the hell is an Osmium Dagger? GQ. Where'd he go? Okay. GQ. Treasure Panda, be careful with that. GQ. GQ. Oh, that's that's literally the block animation from <laughs> that's literally the block animation from from uh, Skyrim. Choo -choo. Choo -choo. Choo -choo. All right. Well, we found a dagger. Yeah, it kind of actually, you know what? It kind of does look like a Power Ranger knife. You're not wrong. From fall. Oh yeah, from Fallout Four. Yep. Same block animation. I'm not hating. I'm just saying it's the same block animation. I'm I'm just pointing it out. Choo -choo -choo. Choo -choo. Yes, plantoids. Choo -choo. No, don't don't shoot the plantoids, TP. Choo -choo. Isn't Osmium stupid heavy? No idea. Well, I think we've effectively cleared this area out so we probably can go report back and tell them that uh that they're they're safe now that all the all the raiders are dead raiders space pirates osmium is a real thing yep osmium is a real thing there's a really fun song somebody made you can find on youtube called, called osmium alloy bomb you should look it up you have another subscriber. Thank you very much for the subscription. Uh, Candid Apollo 2. I really appreciate it, man. Yeah, Osmium Aloe Bomb is a great song. Oh, hey, more areas we didn't explore. Free loot. Choo choo! Ooh. I'm glad I came back here now. There's definitely some good stuff. Ooh, choo choo! Yeah, I want that. That looks cool.
That's the, uh, it's one of the mag, mag weapons. I don't, I, I can't remember what it, um, they're like electromagnetic induction guns, which I, I'm pretty sure that they're inspired by, uh, I can't remember the name of it now. I'm sorry. It's just completely gone. I'm pretty sure they're inspired by a, a different, a, a real life thing that I was talking about earlier and I completely forgot. People hate the gun designs in this game. I think the gun designs in this game are great. I think they're really fun, like science fiction looking guns. They're, they're great. Also, the shotgun rips and I love it. All right, anyway. Choo -choo. They have a robot. Warning. Our own programs to prioritize the completion of our tasks over the safety of nearby humans. Well, that's not good. Don't do that. Choo 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 How am I supposed to get to you when the door is locked, lady? Choo -choo -choo -choo. They're gonna get mad that I do this. Watch. Did you? You guys mad at me now? What's the status? We won't be safe until they're all put to rest. Did you? The Crimson Fleet pirates have been taken care of. Oh, I actually like this one better. There aren't any more pirates at the abandoned farm. Not live pirates, anyway. Not going to lie. That's the best news I've heard of all day. Here, this is yours. What do you want to do empty-handed? Could all use a little downtime. Woo! Free stuff! Well, I, I guess it's not really free. I did I did work for it, didn't I? All right, thanks. And also, I don't know why you locked the door so that I couldn't get in, but thank you. Goodbye. Choo -choo. Um, I didn't try to open the weapon case because I I cannot open uh I cannot open um Why can I use it? Why can I not use my words anymore? I cannot open advanced locks. Thank you. How good is this game so far? I really like it. It's really good. I've really enjoyed playing it. I mean, yeah, it's got some bugs. I'm not gonna lie. It has it has some weird bugs that have showed up. Nothing game-breaking, but it definitely has had some. Um, but yeah, I've really enjoyed playing it. I need to know... <sighs> Where can I go? I need to know where to go to buy more ships. Hmm.
No, I'm, I'm looking for a specific ship that I cannot find. Ooh, what's this? We got a star station that will not contact me. That's good. That's good. Off to a good start. Alright, uh, you know what? No, let's go dock. Let's go see what's going on in the star station. Hang on, before we do that. Oh! Okay, so there's like a settlement here. Is there a settlement? I'm not sure. Well, there's several planets. But, man, I want to find that ship. I just don't know where the hell it would be. Here, I'll even... I'll even I'll, here, we'll do this really quick. Let me show you guys again. No, oh, that's a bad it. That's a bad shot. In case someone is watching that will be able to tell. This I'm looking for this ship. I cannot I don't know where this ship is. Or at least where I can get this cockpit. If you can tell me where I can get this specific cockpit, even that will work. Because I can probably build everything else. But I, I have not been able to find this ship anywhere, and I don't know where it would it would technically spawn. I don't think it's a Stroud cockpit, though. It doesn't look like the other Stroud cockpits. Anyway, yeah. To get it straight from Hope Tech, maybe I don't I I don't know. Where is Hope Tech? That might be something else. Have to look that up later. We board. Much am I carrying? Okay, we got we got we got a decent amount of weight left. Is there anybody uh, on this station? There's a weird grub. But grubs ain't bad, guys. They just grubs. Is the station just abandoned? Looking like it so far. Can we adopt it? I don't really want to. I don't want a grub on my ship. Huh. There really is not much of anything on board this station right now. And it's like somebody already came through and kind of looted everything. Hark to you, author Zach James. Hello. Oh, 
I shouldn't have done that. Hmm. God damn it. So I have to do this one. Oh, wait. There we go. There we go. Easy peasy. Man, stop giving me... Stop giving me legendary laser pistols. I hate laser pistols. I don't want them. I want legendary ballistic weapons. That's what I'm specced into, game. That's what I think of your chest pieces. There we go. All right. I am still looking for where to buy that ship. Yes. The Lego Blaster. Yes, indeed, I have it. Found one earlier. Sort of directed energy weapons would I go for? Well, I do have this thing, which I like so far. It's not that I, I don't dislike laser weapons. I just don't particularly like this laser weapon. This one doesn't really do anything for me. The reason I don't like this laser weapon, I will... I will tell you why I don't particularly like this one. When you reload this... I, lo I love the e-ink display on the back. The e-ink display is cool. I love that that little knob spins. That's really neat. I love a lot of this. I don't like that you replace the lens on the front. I, I, I do not like the reload on this gun. I think the reload on this gun is very, ooh, is very silly. Like the, Unless stuff really changed in the future, the thing that's the thing on a laser gun that's going to be the most expensive is going to be the precision ground lenses and the laser emitter. Unless I guess, well, I guess if the laser emitter itself is inside the white part of the gun, then maybe that would make more sense, but I, I, don't, I just don't like that you rip the lens off the front of the gun. And also because that's where, like, that's where the little, like, aiming laser comes out of there. So, like, I don't know. I'm just not a huge fan of this gun. What does this one even do, anyway? I found, I found some, this one's actually, like, pretty good. Okay, I like the fact that consecutive hits deal more damage, break through even the strongest armor, and it applies a bleed effect. God, come on. Why are you giving me a good version of this? Don't make me like this gun. No, don't make me like this. No, stop. Don't make me equip it. Come on. That's not fair. You can't give me a cool laser gun. God damn it, Todd. How dare you make me like a laser gun. All right, well, there really doesn't seem to be, uh, there really doesn't seem to be much of anything on the station. Oh, that's where I came in. We'll do one, one more quick pass here, but I don't, I don't think there's anything else on the station for me. I 
I mean, I did show up here and get a laser gun, so... Alright, well... Why do I keep picking these things up? I don't want to do crafting. God, come on. Modded to look like the Fallout laser pistol? It kind of already does look like the Fallout laser pistol, if I'm being honest. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Why is there recoil on laser guns? Well, okay, so in Star Wars, there's recoil on laser guns because all of the guns in the original Star Wars saga were just World War II guns that they modified to fire blanks. Um, and blanks do have, like, a tiny amount of recoil, but it's really more of just the action cycling. So... Whoa, that is a blue planet. Wow, that is a uranium rich planet. Holy crap. Well, if you need to mine uranium, that's where you go to. I just imagine a survivor was hearing you shoot randomly and criticize laser guns. <laughs> you know, he very he very well may have been. Alright, what's in the shipping crate? And that will determine whether or not I get any of these other shipping crates. Plutonium! Yeah, alright, fine. Oh, I need to repair, jeez. Set course! Hello? Ah. Free Star Rail Star! Uh, hey, how's it going? Uh, you got anything good? Oh, uh, sure. Take a look. Not much. Alright, never mind. Goodbye! Just out here scanning planets, don't mind me. All right, um, let's go, let's see. Can I get to Voli? That's too far, so we can go, we can go to Cheyenne and then warp from there, so let's go back. Oh, got a point away from the planet. Jeez. Jeez. Do not point at the planet when you're about to grab drive, Zach. Come on. Careful. Don't point at the planet. This is Free Star Collective Space. Hold while we scan your ship. Okay. 
Oh, hey, I can stop here and sell trap too. That's that's a good idea. Can you actually pancake yourself into a plan if you try to FTL towards it? Uh, I don't think so. In fact, I'm almost positive you cannot. Um, that's just like a weird role playing thing I'm doing because I'm weird. Uh, I came up with the, I came up with this idea because I kept I kept moving the ship away from planets before I would grab jump, and I came up with a role playing thing that. Uh, most space truckers will do that because there's a on the slim chance that for some reason your grab your grab drive engages but fails it propels your ship at nearly the speed of light directly into the surface of the planet which then obliterates most of the planet so, like, space truckers are just like, eh, better safe than sorry. Just point their ship away from a planet before they engage their grav drive. You know, just in case. And so, because this is space trucker Zack, I figured that he would, uh, he would do that. Ah, oh, damn it, they have no money. And just for the record, that is not actually in game. None of that is none of that is canon. It's just something that I made up while I was playing, and I thought it would be fun to actually just consistently do that. Every time I grab jump, I have to remember to point the ship away from planets. Sure, outlaws, Ashta, those bandits from the Shaw Gang. Just so you know, keep it to self-defense. Oh wait, sell. All right, so we'll sell the Yeah, we'll sell this one. I guess we'll sell this regulator. Why am I in free side? Cuz I'm selling crap. To head over to Mick and Ralph's. I'll go over there when I'm done here. All right, so I like the mag. Mm, I like the mag shot a lot, actually. A longer barrel on it. Mm, maybe. Yeah. Do I put a long? Do I put the longer barrel on the mag shot? We'll think about it. We'll consider it. I don't know why I'm even looking at compensators. I can't put any of those on there anyway. All right. Modified pacifier. I kind of want to take the stock off this thing. Like, I really... I like it better without the stock. I'm going to be honest. We're removing the stock from the, from the pacifier. Can I put choke on here yet? No, because I don't have muzzle mods. Blah! Okay, fine. Have I been to any in-game museums? Uh, I have not yet. I probably should. Shoddy. We are definitely putting a longer barrel on, on Shoddy. Optic. Hmm... Optic might not be a bad idea for the shoddy. Or the laser. And I can put ta oh, tactical grip? Hmm. Good god, you can make that full auto. That is ske I that would be sketchy. I got too many freaking guns that I'm carrying right now. Jeez. The long barrel on this, because that does make it a little bit better. Put the no laser sight. 
put the reflex sight. Yeah, dude, that makes... Okay, jo Joko Beast, that makes me so mad that I can't take mods. If I take a mod off a gun, I can't put it on another gun. Like, come on. Just let me take stuff off the gun and put it on another one. That's absolutely infuriating that you cannot do that. I put this optic on this shotgun. I could put this optic on the shotgun. Might just leave it with the iron sights. We'll leave it with the iron sights for now. I kind of like it just like that. I don't know if I want to put sights on that yet either. Like, honestly, dude, the gun designs in this game are really good. I think the gun designs look great. I don't know, man, I don't know what to, I don't, actually don't know what to do about the, the, the firearms in this game. How much am I carrying right now? I'm at 103. I need to get rid of some, some crap. Choo -choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. Let's go see if that lady has the gun we want yet. I'm sure she doesn't. Choo -choo -choo. No, I, I am actually planning on doing a gun rant at some point. There's a trade authority here and I never realized it. Oh my god. A beep boop. How did I completely forget there was a trade authority here, Treasure Panda? Choo -choo. I need to sell you what things. What brings you to the trade authority? The trade authority looks to partner with local governments to find mutually beneficial arrangements. Neat. That sounds great. What do you do? I'm the local representative for the organization. In that Choo -choo. capacity, I work with merchants and business people and local leaders to make sure trade flows regularly and efficiently to and from the city. With the long lag times of interstellar communication, we wanted to have someone here in person to talk face to face and make quick decisions. After all, the Trade Authority's work is vital to the continued growth and prosperity of Aquila City. Choo choo. Great. Um, let me see what we got. Huh. Down to business then. Choo choo. Ooh. Chunky. I'm still very confused about the fact that I have this regulator that for some reason is doing 162 damage. I don't know why it's doing so much damage. I don't know if my game glitched and it just gave me a regulator that does bonkers damage. I really don't know. Like, I don't think it should be doing that much damage. Did you? Hmm. What do you think, Treasure Panda? Did you? What if he's got anything else? Go oh yeah, that's right. I got. I picked up packs and stuff. Oh, I do like that helmet. That helmet does look really cool. We're going to keep that for now. Maybe I can modify it. I don't want to be April O'Neil. Thank you very much. GGG. All right. 
What else do you have that I might be interested in? Absolutely nothing. I'm, I want those pancakes. Thank you. Do 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 do. All right. And now we'll see if she has the gun I want yet. Um, I think you'll find that we carry. Yes, of course. Gun, 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 gun. Give me... Why does she still not have it? This is going to drive me absolutely insane. I just want the normal version of that gun. Grumpy Zack is grumpy. Too chill. All right. Back to the ship. To you. We'll put some stuff away in the ship. We will hopefully head to where maybe the ship I'm looking for is. I have no idea if it's actually there though. Beep boop. Choo choo. Choo choo. Oh, and Treasure Panda took emote only chat with him when he left. Alright, so we'll put away this Tonto and we'll put away. Uh, there are weapon display racks. Yes, there are, there are weapon display racks that you can put weapons on in this game. I'm going to put that away. Put this away. Man, it's really hard for me to choose between these two. I like both of these guns a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's seven G's. It's a lot of weapons that I'm carrying right now. But I kind of feel like I don't need to be carrying so many. But I can't decide what to not carry. No, you get a filigree covered version of the of that pistol if you join the Freestar Rangers, and I don't like filigree on weapons, because I'm going to be stupid about this. Hmm. I really I don't know what guns to put away. I need to put some guns away. I guess this one, because I haven't really used it. We'll try using this one, because I didn't really even try it on anything yet. That'll work. Alright. Oh, I probably should actually... Oh, okay, good. They're all... That is in the correct spot. That goes there. And that one goes there. Great! Haven't even built your first outpost yet? You know, it's under, it took me forever to build my first outpost and then I have done absolutely nothing with it because I don't, I don't enjoy uh, outpost building. Let's see if we can go to...
here. Shipbuilding, on the other hand, yeah, I love shipbuilding. I have done entirely too much shipbuilding in this game. Shipbuilding is my favorite. I'll spend ex exorbitant amounts of time going from one place to another place to find a specific ship that I probably won't even be able to buy when I get to it. Hey, I leveled. Woo! All right. Um, we are going to put this level into... What are we going to put it into? I can't put it into ballistics yet because I got to kill 100 things with ballistic weapons. Could put it into pistol certification. Could put it into shotgun certification. Hmm. Weightlifting. Actually, yeah, I could put it in security so I could get advanced locks. That might, yeah, that's actually probably a really good idea. There's a Skyrim reference in one of these? Yeah, there is. It's, um, I'll find it. This one. See? Arrow to the knee! Ha ha! Arrow to the knee! Alright, um, yeah, we'll do security. And, then we'll see if we can go to... I think... This is, I need to point away from the planet, where I need to head to. Welcome to Free Star Space. We're gonna do a quick scan for contraband, you can be on your way. Great. Oh boy, Neon! Show chat the sweet roll description. Oh, um, yeah, here, let me see if I can find it. Oh, wait. Ah, God damn it. It's, it's back up there. Whoops. Aid. There it is. Made from honey, flour, and any number of special ingredients. Sweet rolls are considered to be the tastiest treat in any universe. Look at that. Sweet rolls. I should put those. Oh man, I should put that on a, on a shelf on my on my ship. All right, we're gonna land on Neon. And hopefully that's where uh, the the company that makes the ships is uh, is located. Do I still have the random piece of toast? I think so. Neon is where my character is from. And now having landed, I have to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back.
All right, all right, we're back. Ship's on a different planet. It's on Polvo in Hopetown. I don't know where that is. Where's Polvo? Is it in this system? Velo system. Where the hell is the Velo system? I'm at the... Oh, I'm at Voli, not Velo. Where the hell is Velo system? Time for spa- oh god, land nav, aka space nav. Space nav is definitely worse than land nav. Where the heck is... It's probably gonna be like literally on the other side of the galaxy. in the same spot as Narion. Oh, God. All right, well, we'll have to go there. We'll see what ships are available here, and then we'll head there. Oh! Okay, no, wait, I did the right... I pressed the right button, sorry. Had a mini panic attack there. Neon, this is home for my character. This is home for Space Zack. I don't think I need to sell anything to Trade Authority. I need to talk to a ship guy, though. I mean, this is ship services. Where the hell is the ship services, dude? Hey, where'd ship services go? Do you know? All right, fine. Don't tell me. I don't care. It. Hey, wait, no. Hi there. Hello, Australian accent man. Oh, is it you? Yeah, you. Uh, where is the ship technician? He was on. He was on Smoko. All these people are holding clipboards, so they all look like they're official. This is typical. Typical neon. Can't find anyone. They're all off at the bar somewhere, getting loaded. That was an Aussie? Yeah, let me see if I can find him again. I'll talk to him again. You can you can tell. No worry. Your ship's in good hands. See? Unless I'm wrong, and then in which case I deeply apologize. Where the hell is the ship technician? Ship selling guy tend to fall through the map here. Ah fuck. Seriously? gonna make me real mad if he fell through the map. Alright, well, we're putting this coffee pot on my ship anyway. I also wish I could get rid of some of these keys. Once again, Todd, key ring. You need a key ring in your game. I hate this. I hate that I can't do anything with this. There needs to be a separate section for keys. Why haven't you figured that out yet, Todd? Anyway, all right, that's enough yelling at Todd. Hello, Wilby. All right, where is this gonna go? I feel like it's gonna go... It needs to go somewhere good. I just don't know exactly where. 
What am I knocking over? A cup. It's fine. We'll put it right here for now. Stovetop? Maybe. I'm going to put it on this little desk for right now. And we'll put the cigarettes right here. On this tray. Thought I quit? I mean, I did quit. Uh, oh, actually, you know what? No, here, we'll do what my dad did. I don't know why he kept the cigarettes in the freezer, but he did. It seems weird to me. You know? Seems weird to anybody else? It seems weird to me. Look, why? What? He didn't smoke. No, he smoked. Um, I don't remember what my bro I don't remember what my brand my dad smoked most often. I think it was Marlboros. Probably to keep them fresh, but that doesn't work. Yeah, I know. That's why. That's what I thought. I thought it was really strange that he did that. But I also think it's really strange that the game does like this, where the thing like phases through something. You have to come back in and pick it up again. And then put it back down again. Yeah, I don't really know where to put this. I want to put this somewhere better. Because it looks so cool. I just don't, I don't know where it should go. Oh, wait a minute. Oops. There we go. Look at that. Look how nice that looks. Oh, lovely. I'm 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 tickled about that. All right, let's have a quick nap. Alright, well, I'm, I'm really annoyed that the ship sales guy is, uh, is nowhere to be found. Did he fall off? Interior decorator, Zach? I am actually pretty good at interior decorating. Uh-oh. You know, I was kind of hoping that that would just kill me. There's a showroom in Neon between Seacart's Outfitters and the Emporium. <laughs> Say hi to this ship, too, while you're down there. Oh, yeah, does that does that freak anybody out? An ocean where you can't... any any Does that freak anybody out? Any body of water where you can't see the bottom? Oh, thank you very much for the gifted subscriptions, Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. I can't believe I missed those. My, my stream is, like, fucking up and not, not doing it. Oh, goodness, so many gifted subscriptions. Oh, my God. You must really hate money. Three more gifted subscriptions from Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. Thank you so much, man. Oh. Is this guy gonna get mowed down? I wanna shoot too. So, what was your plan? Smuggle the Aurora into a cruise city on New Atlantis? 
Jay, 69 subs, LMAO. Yep, honest mistake. You guys got some cool armor. Let's go. Alright, oh, fine, we'll just not do that. James knew I'd better watch this. I'm gonna get in the elevator with you guys, hope you don't mind. The word uh, for the phobia of long words proves the doctors hate patients. Well, the actual name is... The actual name for the fear of long words is... Escopedialiophobia. Uh, but the fake, goofy name for the fear of long words is Hippopotomonstrosescopedialiophobia. I can spell that word. I can, I can spell that word. I promise I can. How do I know that? Because I I wrote a bunch of that stuff down when I was in high school, and it's just it's just permanently stuck in my brain. But I can spell the word hippopotomonstrosescopedialiophobia. It's h i p p o p o t o m o n s t r o s e s q u i p p e d a l i o p h o b i a. I am very stupid. Like, why Why is that inside my brain? Why is that inside my brain? I said it fast. That's how you know I know it. <laughs> yeah, like, why is that Why is that in my forever memory? You know what the fear of otters is? It's lutrophobia. Why is that in my memory? Why is the fear of otters in my permanent memory? Lutrophobia is in there. I can't remember how to do my taxes, but the fear of otters and how to spell Hippopotomonstrosescopedialiophobia is permanently in my brain. Stroud Eklund. What's the fear of needles? No idea. I'm happy you've come by our showroom today. Thank you. Buy ships. What do you got? Privateer. Galileo. Roanoke. Narcissus. Conqueror. Private. All right. Well, none of those are. Let's see something real quick. We're going to do this. We're going to go to Shipbuilder and we're going to delete. All these components and see what cockpits are available. None of the ones that are okay, so the cockpit I want is not available. All right. Ship looks like one of those rival prospects in Deep Rock Galactic. It kind of does, actually. All right, all right. Well, we need to go because we are in completely the wrong place. I went to completely the wrong place, but I'm glad I found Neon. It's nice to have found Neon. I'll have to come back here later. I don't have time to explore it right now. We're very busy. We must find... The SS Milk Crate. I, that was dangerously close to that tower. Holy crap. Space Trucker Zack does not care. Do I know if I can buy a place on my home planet? I actually don't know. Maybe I can. Maybe I can buy a home on Neon. That would actually be kind of cool. 
All right, we need to go to... I forget where they said it was. Ah, here. So we need to go to Olympus first. Uh, give this planet a scan while we're here. Great. You know, I still haven't been to that one. I need to remember that. We need to go to Aaron A3 later. I need to, like, make a note of that somewhere. I think you can do that on Steam now. Can't you make notes on Steam? You can make notes! Need... Need to go to Aaron A3 later. Derelict Star State. Oh, wait. That's... Is that... Oh, hang on. Hang on. Okay, we need to go to... It's just called Aaron A. There's no three. Great. Need to go to Aaron A3 and visit the Derelict Star Station. Excellent. Choo-choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. All right, and then now we need to go to Thalo. Point away from the planet. No, you're supposed to hold your current heading, Treasure Panda. Oh my god. Did you? Did you? Did you? Fulvo Station. We land on Hope Town. Hopefully. Haha. -ha. Did you? Treasure Panda, do you have a fear of otters? Mm, did you? He says no. He likes otters. How about foxes? No, I bet the fear of foxes is uh, Volpa, Volpa, Volpa's phobia. Volpa's, I don't know, whatever. Did you? All right, I really hope the SS milk crate is available here. You. What do you do? Hang on, I want to see this. He tells everyone you met the Ron Hope. I mean, Ron Hope's, well, friendly and incredible. You too. Everyone on the factory floor bumps into him on occasion. It's not that big of a deal. My brother, the big shot at Hope Tech. Let's get you settled in. You too. All right. What if the milk crate is level locked and doesn't show up until you're like level forty something? That would be disappointing. Plenty of havoc gets left unchecked. Okay, sure. We'll take care of any holes, broken seals, that kind of thing. Did you? Get make sure you take all the treasure pandas that are running around inside the ship and just put them back into the main area. They'll escape and get all over the place again anyway. But it's you know it's it's just a fun game they play. Did you? Sure. How about it? Oh, wait, I didn't mean to do this one. Well, it's fine. We'll do this. We'll see if the cockpit I want is available. It isn't. Where the hell is it? Did you? I'm sure you can find something you like. Alright. That's kind of neat looking. Did you? That's also kind of neat. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. God damn it. Did you? Why 
is it the one thing that I want isn't in isn't freaking here apparently? Okay, no problem. Hmm. Chew. Ooh, we got the big old chunky reactors now. Choo choo choo. Some interesting fuselages, though. Ooh! Oh my god, you need Starship Design Rank 1. God damn it. Hmm... Well, I can put those engines on things now, though, so that's fun. All right. Did you? Where the hell do I find? This ship. Choo -choo. Where do I find the ship? I must know. Hopetown HQ. All right, I will check at Hopetown HQ. Choo -choo. What if it's a custom build? I mean, that was, that oh was God. in, that was in this game. Like I, I, that, I took that screenshot. Excuse me, a little desperate here. No, not right now. I gotta find a ship. Yeah. What? Did Build a ship dock on an outpost? No, I'm not doing crafting. I hate it so much. Off work. Just keep it holstered. I'll get along fine. All right, great. Uh, play hard here. Sales. Choo choo. If you get the credits, we got what you need. Choo choo. The Hope Tech sales. Give me your invoice. You got the financing set up already? Uh, I don't know. I don't. I'm. I'm thinking of buying something. I'm just not sure yet. Oh, a potential customer, huh? Well, what you need to know about our ships is they're from stern about built for reliability other star yards might got glitz and some weird crazy lines with hope tech you get people that care about you making that 300 freight run safely and on time Ooh, choo -choo. okay i like the sound of that a smart person chooses substance over form every time mm. sound familiar choo -choo. what are you in the market for in the market for all kinds of ships. Let me see. Let me see. Sure. All right. What do we got? Star semi? No. Silent runner? No. Pick up? That looks like the correct cockpit. That's it. That's the ship. That's the, that's the one. Woo! The SS Milk Crate. Oh my God! And I have enough money for it. Choo -choo! The SS Milk Crate. You guys, we are buying the SS Milk Crate. I'm going to spend all of my money on a ship. <laughs> Holy crap. Look how much cargo capacity this thing has. Oh my god, dude. Choo choo. That is, that is, this is a treasure right here. Look at this thing. Oh, it's chunky. Okay, so... I'm already thinking about what we can do. Because I think we can do some treasure panda. I think we can do some modifications to this. 
I think there's some things we can do to the ship that will make it, uh... Even, uh, even, even more... Chunky. Choo-choo! <laughs> Thank you for the four bits, Thanos 93. Alright. What do, what do we have on the ship? We've got... Laser, ballistic. Good engines. Mortar emplacement on the roof. I'm thinking we can probably put something a little further up with like a couple more cannons on it, maybe. But I think we can definitely work with this because this thing looks cool. Oh, actually, having seen this, I might be able to... The problem is I need the cockpit. See, I, I would love... Subscriber. Ooh, thank you very much, Lobster Landmine. Wait, I wasn't done talking to you. I'm sorry. Okay. Never sleeps. Let me show you our inventory. Great. All right, so if... If they have that cockpit available... We can just build our own version of that ship. We've got to have more money I guess it is that cockpit overseer 300 bridge and it's it's locked behind starship design rank one shit all right so yeah we'll probably have to straight up buy that ship can I help you certainly We'll probably have to buy it. That one does look pretty cool too. But I already have that cockpit, so we don't need that. <laughs> Goodness, are you okay, Treasure Panda? <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna be okay there? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Says he swallowed a bug. <laughs> it's a little funny, you gotta admit. Alright. Yeah, I say we buy this one. I think I think we get this. We can modify it a little more after the fact, but I double check options four and five. I mean, this one's cool, but I cannot. No, I can't afford this one. I just don't know if I necessarily want this one. Is that the ship you were looking for? Yes, that is the exact ship I was looking for. Yeah, I, I you know what? We're we're just we're just gonna get it. I already have this guy, and I've heavily modified him at this point. Ooh, also had an idea. Hang on, um, we are gonna buy this one. Great. All right. So now. I have hours of invoices to go over, so let's make it quick. Sure. Okay, we'll make it quick. Yeah, the little mob. All right, we need to rename it though. Actually, do we rename it, little mob? Do we rename it to the SS Milk Crate? Did you? Ooh, box boy or just milk crate? Oh uh, yeah, milk crate might be a good name. Yeah. Did you do? The ship has been renamed Milk Crate. Oh, uh, yeah, that's fine. The milk crate. Did you? All right, so we're going to go back into Shipbuilder. What is this one? That is the Engineering Bay. We've got a Hope Tech Engineering Bay and then a Hope Tech Captain's Quarters. I think this... How many... Okay, max crew of three, so I can carry other passengers, which is good. Move that around. 
I like this antenna post. I like this ship. The ship looks really good. It might need more grab jump fuel than 50, though. Maybe we can get... We put another 50 on there. So now I've got more fuel for longer distance. Thought I didn't want a crew. I don't want a crew, but one of the things you can do is transport passengers. And you need crew space in order to transport passengers. So that is, that is actually important. Can we remove this? And add... Where'd structural go? There we go. Hmm. Did you? Apparently I can't add a weapon plate to that. That's a little unfortunate, I think. What if... Why can I not move? Oh, because the... Alright, so delete this. See, now we're getting into the part of the game that I enjoy entirely too much, which is just shipbuilding. I freaking love shipbuilding. Look at how much cooler that looks with that way in front. I'm doing Uber, the ship needs to smell like incense. <laughs> Alright, what if we do... If I what are what are the what are the current warnings? Missing a weapon assignment and low reduced mass or add engines to improve transport. Okay, so that didn't increase anything. And then now we add We add either add an all in one berth. Oh, we might have to add an all-in-one berth if I want to transport passengers. Or... We add an armory. And then we replace this one. With... Crew compartment. Maybe. Maybe. That might, that might work. So what engines do I have available? Because I might want to use higher thrust engines if I can. Commercial inter interplanetary flights must be a thing. You shouldn't have to hitch a ride with a gun, not pilot, and a ship full of treasure pandas. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with treasure pandas, TP. All right, let's see. Um, so we put the all-in-one berth. Did you? I think this is looking decent so far. We can still put weapons up there. Auto cannon. Dang! That is a chunky auto cannon. Did you? Hull damage fourteen versus hull damage of eleven, but the fire rate's way higher. Hmm. Look at structural really quick. Because man, I love modifying ships.
What is Treasure Panda's favorite snack? Treasure Panda, what's your favorite snack? Choo choo! Pizza, he says. TP really likes pizza. Choo choo, choo choo. He absolutely loves it. Huh, that's weird that I can't move that. Alright, so that increased my mobility, or decreased my mobility to 51. You. We probably need a laser on there to damage shields. I mean, like, this thing is not really going to be very good at, uh... Ooh, that's a cool-looking laser. Like, this ship is not going to be very good at combat. Did you... Hmm. Have I bought any of the, or have I found any of the old earth weapons? I have. Some really good ones. It's interesting that Hope Tech has, like, no weapon mounting solutions. I'm not complaining, it's just interesting. But. But. You. Now that we have this ship, we can fly back to UC Collective Space and attach Deimos things on it. You. And then, that will give us more firepower by attaching Deimos things to it. Let's take it for a test drive? Yes, in just a moment. That's the reactor it had. It had an 18 reactor. What if we put... A B-class 16 reactor in it. Chew. Well, it, yeah, that was 18. Alright. We're going we're gonna to cancel out of this. We're just going to take it as is right now. And take it for a little test drive. Did you? Thank you. All right. Did you? What year is this game set in? I think it's like twenty three something. Did you? Did, did you? Well, thank you for stopping by, Treasure Panda. Uh, this lady was trying to talk to me. Why did I ever take this? Why? I don't know. Why did you? All right, Adela. Deep breath. <sighs> oh God. What? I'm. I. I. Are you gonna throw up? That's. A, that's a common reaction by from looking at me. I understand. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm just great. Grand, really. When I signed on to be a freight captain, I was expecting long hours and dull routes. And now I'm a hair away from being executed. Or worse. Fun! I'm a captain too. You are sincerely the answer to my prayers. So, I fly a rust bucket called the Markab for a small shipping line. Just started, really. We do bulk shipping, boring stuff like actuators and seed stock and minerals. Have you ever had a standard, boring job just blow up in your face? <laughs> yeah, like every single one of them. It's, I mean, that's the, literally the story of my life. You get it then. So, I just got assigned to the Markov. The first shipment, slag steel. Nothing special. As soon as I left Neon and got scanned, things got crazy. Spacers, three-star security, the works. Everyone demanding I power down, hand over the contraband, or sometimes just firing first. I skipped the system, ditched the cargo, and have been running ever since. Well, that, that sucks. What the hell were you actually shipping? I don't know. I was just flying for my life. But some bad people want it. Okay. Um. So, that sucks. It gets even worse. 
Oh boy. A tracker just landed and I just know he's hunting a bounty. Me. But the trick is, everyone knows the ship. But my info isn't in the database yet. All they got is my last name, Fahim. So if you go into the pit stop and claim you're Captain Fahim of the Markab, maybe you can deal with the tracker? Hmm. How do they only know your name? The company is, well, <laughs> a real train wreck. I'm amazed they even have my last name on file. For once, working for such a dump is a good thing. How am I supposed to deal with this tracker? I don't know. I don't want anyone to get hurt. But he may not give you any choice. And why would I do that? Listen, I just call, well, garbage. But you, I mean, you're armed and look, well, awesome. I figure you could do a solid for the little guy, uh, girl. Plus credits. I did mention the credits, right? I mean, I would prefer a cool gun, but I guess I'm Captain Fahim then. You are the best. This slate has everything they know about me. It's not much. He's the one with the cowboy hat. Just stay safe. Thank you. All right, well, shotgun ready? Okay, great. Okie dokie. Mission. Ron hopes the best thing that happened to him. Ooh, we get to fly my new ship there. Yay, new ship. New ship, new ship, new ship, new ship, new ship, new ship, new ship. The milk crate. Welcome aboard the milk crate, everyone! Here we have the engineering sector. It's dirty and filthy. It looks like the movie Alien, and I love it in here. Th There's stuff breaking already! This is amazing! I'm tearing up thinking about how great this ship is! We're gonna have to remove that window in the floor. I don't like that. I don't want people being able to see out into space. All right, coming up the stairs. Wait a minute. There's a whole other section of this ship that I didn't get to see. Where is it? Also, this does feel like the inside of a tractor. It's pretty great. Down we go. Ah, oh, you gotta climb up a second ladder. To the captain's quarters. We may change the captain's quarters to passenger compartment. We'll see. Oh, my stuff fell over. Oh, wee. Look at him. He's a friend. Who knocked all my jars and plates over? God damn it. Well, there is a bathroom in here. That's nice. A beep boop. Hmm. This may get changed for a crew compartment. I'll have to see. I don't mind this though. Wait, do I have a galley? That's important. I don't. No galley? Get rid of it. All right. All right, take off. Let's see what this baby can do. What this baby can do will not be much. It's, uh, it's not built for speed. Oh yeah, listen to that engine purr. All right, what is my... Whoops, wrong one. I did the wrong mission. I shouldn't have even taken off. Uh-oh. Whoopsie doodle. Well, let's take a look at this thing in space. See how it handles. Got a speed of 71. How is this thing faster? How is this actually faster than my other ship? 
in... What? That doesn't make any sense to me, but alright. I don't understand how the... how this guy is faster than my other ship, a but it is. Subscription. How generous. Look how cool it looks. Thank you so much, Kami Tommy, for the gifted subscription. I really appreciate it. This this ship looks cool though. I am I am into how this thing looks. We're gonna have to do some minor modifications to it. But we will get right on that once we complete this mission. You guys knocked it out of the park with subscriptions to or with uh with subs today. Holy crap. With 71 subs. Thank you so much, you guys. You guys have been doing just I don't want to hear you complaints. Just getting, it's been so nice. Alright. Howdy. Shotgun. H howdy. A gifted subscription. How generous. Ooh. You guys didn't see that it just happen. You didn't. You didn't see that. It's fine. Ignore that. Thank you very much, Sim. Uh, uh Sai Mitia Samidia. Sai Mitia. Uh, thank you very much for the gift of subscription. That guy is teleporting through the thing. Hang on, we're gonna we're gonna do this real quick. Choo -choo. Hello, Treasure Panda. Treasure Panda, are you gonna talk this guy down? Choo -choo. Choo -choo -choo. Where is it? Do do. Drugs. Do do. My guy, you're having some problems there. Are you gonna be okay? As dives go, this place ain't bad. Do do. I'm newly down. You look like you just got here too, eh? What's your name, stranger? I'd buy you a drink. Uh, my name is Captain Fahim. It's a pleasure to meet you. I will take that drink out. I will take that drink now. Fahim, huh? Came in on that ship to Markov? Choo choo. A gifted know. subscription. How generous. Oh, I'm a tracker. Thank you I very much know. for the gift of subscription, Pasta. Who is this can go? You know the deal. Mm. You gonna shoot me here? Looks like a place that doesn't mind some color. Or you can surrender. I drank you up, deliver you, they kill you. Nobody ever picks that option. Why don't we come to an arrangement? Choo -choo. I don't deal with smugglers on the good times. What I do is like more refined than that. My words, my bond. Tell you what, man. Why don't... You, you really don't seem that bad, and I haven't done anything wrong. And I really don't want to peel open the top of your head like it's an overripe banana with a 12-gauge shotgun. So, why don't we not do this? So you didn't shoot your way off me, Nan Fahim? The bounty is pretty damn good. But something You have another right. subscriber. Did you? Thank you very much for the subscription, Batu Sax. Hmm. Adela doesn't deserve a bounty on her. The whole thing doesn't add up, apparently. Maybe. Choo -choo. Maybe not. Can we convince him? Yeah, you're the one that said it smells fishy. That thing that smells might be you. Damn it. Hey, wait, I can auto persuade. The bounty is awfully large for what they're saying. Yeah. All right, I'm not taking you in. But that just means somebody else will. Choo -choo. Whatever you were shipping, you got to return it. The next tracker will probably want to be as upstanding as you. Uh, unfortunately, cargo got jettisoned. <laughs> There's no way they're ever going to settle for that. Ah, sucks to be you. One more drink and it's lift off. Choo -choo. Yeah, one more drink and it's lift off. Choo choo! Choo choo! Ooh, choo choo! 
Choo choo! Choo choo choo! Treasure Panda, why did you. We talked our way out of it! You didn't have to do that! Choo choo! A gifted subscription, how generous. Choo choo! <laughs> Thank you very much for the gifted subscription, Pasta. Man, yeah, that guy just ate those shotgun shells, though. Got anything cool on him? Choo choo! Alright. <laughs> you can't just do that to people, Treasure Panda! Choo choo! <laughs> My god. All right. I did I know that you wanted to shoot stuff, Treasure Panda. I know. I'm you know, I should have let you. I did let you. Now, let's see what she says about this. This can't be happening. A gifted subscription, how generous. Goodness gracious, thank you so much for so many gifted subscriptions, Pasta. Oh, well, I convinced the tracker to let you go. I feel like I can finally breathe again. Thank you. I mean, you know the only way the corp is going to let you go is by returning their cargo. You're right. I'll see what I can do. You're a literal lifesaver. Choo choo. Choo choo choo. We did it. Choo choo. Nice work, Treasure Panda. Well, I guess all's well that ends well. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Your time, you're valuable. A gifted you subscription. How generous. Thank you very much. 22 gifted subs from Pasta of the Mongolian Empire. I really appreciate it, man. Choo choo choo. Choo choo. Well, thank you for stopping by once again, Treasure Panda. I really appreciate all of the gifted subs you guys give. You have another subscriber. And thank you, Clothorn, for the subscription. Man, I love how the inside of this ship looks. God, the inside of this looks cool as hell. This just, like, this just screams alien to me. I love it. A gifted subscription, how generous. Good God, man. Thank you so much. No crew yet? No. No, no crew yet. I don't really want to have a crew in this game. We're going to have to, like, redo this because everything fell all over the place in here. Forgot TP has a cooldown. You were going to redeem it and say I didn't hear no bell. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like that all the loot, all the uh, all the loose items get sent to the cargo hold every time because it does mean you have to sell all of them like over and over again, which is really annoying. Look at oh my god! Look how much space that cargo hold has. Holy crap! How long is TP's cooldown? Uh, about thirty minutes. I know, but Vasco gets stuck on weird things on the inside of the ship, and that really irritates me. Let's go, SS Milk Crate. No treasure panda shenanigans for a half hour. Yeah, well, I'm I'm probably gonna end the stream in a little bit here. It's probably time for me to start getting ready for bed. Can we? Oh, we can't go to Wolf. It's too far. Go to Alpha Centauri. Uh, yeah, 
yeah, we'll go to Alpha Centauri and we'll land on... That's true, I am running on 50 grab fuel. We're going to have to... The, we're going to do some minor modifications to the ship. We're going to do some minor things. With the robotics bay, like on the frontier, Vosco never comes on the ship. How do you add a robotics bay, though? Because I have no idea. Anything I can help you with? How about it? Does Treasure Panda prefer Pit Vipers or Ray Bans? Ah, uh, Pit Vipers. All right, so here's what we'll do. We're gonna go into Ship Builder. Yeah, Vasco gets stuck in my modules, like, all the time, which is why I just sent him back, because I got tired of him just constantly being stuck. Hope Tech, uh, all in one berth. Is it glitch that prevents you from naming ships? Uh, not on my end. It seems to work fine for me. Alright, so, here's what I'm thinking. We do... Boop. I said... A boop? Why can I not move that forward now? Oh, because the stupid porthole! Move that up, move that there. Fuel tank. Uh, we want the 50, so now I have 100 fuel, and that looks really good right there. So now you'll come up here, and then there will be a second... Oh, uh, there's gonna be ladders in weird spots now. Shit. Hmm. Well, let's see. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, wait, before I do any of this, crap. Before I do any of this... It did autosave, but we'll do a hard hey, save. What can I do for you? Okay, no problem. And then we will take a look at this ship builder. Delete this porthole. Delete this. Put in... Where's Habitats? Habs. Add the... I kind of want to see what the Nova Galactic Armory looks like. So let's add that one. Nova Galactic Armor Armory. And then let's see if there's any other versions of that engine we can pop on there. That looks kind of cool with it angled like that. Do you guys think it looks better like this? Or like that? I, you know, the square one probably looks better. Honestly, I think the square one probably looks better. I mean, it does fit with how everything else looks on there, so. Oops. Well, actually, well, wait, hang on. So we've got square engine. Keep it cube? Yeah, probably should remain cube. The angled one is cool, but I don't know if it fits. So we're gonna... Well, oh, but that, here's the problem, though. 
But look how the angle, angled ones got like gold trim on it and then like warning labels and stuff. That looks cool. They're both really cool. Hmm. Hmm. Here, let's let's put the, uh, the other one on there. How generous. Thank you so much, Pasta, for another gifted subscription. Twenty-four subs from Pasta. Thank you so much, man. All right. So, oh, we need to replace this one with the, none of this is permanent right now, by the way. I'm, this is, this is just me testing stuff. Hope tech all in one instead of the captain's berth. And before we leave. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I have one more idea for something we can do. And then I probably need to... What the... What is happening? What the... Alright, that was weird. I have one more idea before we go. We go to structural... Yes, we can put a horizon weapon mount on there. And now... Oh my god, it'll let me do it. We can add more cannons to this ship. Alright, so what we do... Oh my god, this is gonna be so fucking sick. What is that specific cannon that's up there? Well, I shouldn't I shouldn't worry about the cannons right now. I that's not that's not a major concern. Um but I can add more weapons to this ship, which is kind of absurd that I can do that. All right. Flight check, what are the current warnings? Missing a weapon assignment, reduce mass. Ah, that's fine. Here, we will What is on Oh, it's be yeah, it's I don't have a weapon to to put in there. Particle beans, good shield zap and hull smash. That's a I will I will have to consider that. But we are going to accept. And we're gonna look what the inside of the ship looks, and then I probably need to get going to bed. I think that looks cooler with the loading bay being right there. I think that looks sick. With the loading bay just like right at the front. Alright, so, you come up here, it's a little annoying where the ladders are, where they are. I'm gonna have to see if I can change that. This one goes to the cockpit. That's cool, I like that. Storage crate. And then this goes both up and down now. Ladders are, yeah, ladders are a pain in the ass to adjust. I think this looks cooler than the captain's quarters, but that is entirely personal preference. This is the same one that's on my other ship. And this is the armory! Does it have closable doors? Oh, I was going to be real excited if you could actually close the doors in the armory. I... Hmm. Ooh. I kind of like how this armory looks. You're going to put a full spacesuit in this armory? Oh my god, this armory is way better. Oh, why is this armory so much better than the Deimos armory? This one looks sick. All right, all right. I'm going to I'm going to show you guys. Hang on. How do I Okay, there we go. 
It just it just takes a little bit of navigation to get off the ladder. I'm gonna show you guys what the Deimos armory looks like because I don't think it looks as good. Yeah, and you get helmet and backpack stands. Yes. Weapon cases and sometimes such sometimes glitch and drop everything in your cargo. As long as it goes into your ship cargo and not just into nowhere, I don't care. All right. I'm going to show you guys. Okay, no problem. I'm going to show you guys what the Deimos armory looks like and why I think this one is better. And then I need to get going to bed. Deimos all in one, Deimos armory. Great. There's got it. I wonder if there's going to be a better way for me to place all these ladders. I I feel like there has to be. Yep, I know. Every time you edit your ship, everything goes in the army. That's why I try to... That's why I try to edit my ship as few times as possible. Alright. You know what? You know, now that I'm thinking about it, the name Milk Crate for this thing is great because not only is it square like a milk crate, but it carries a lot of stuff like a milk crate. Usually just go with boost to get up a ladder. Ah, oh, that's not a bad idea, honestly. Alright, so this is the Deimos Armory. I... I think the, uh, I think the Nova one looks... I think the Nova Armory looks way better. Like, I think this one looks okay, looks good. But I think the Nova Armory looks better. This one's almost a little too clean, I think. If that makes any sense. I like the weapon crates. Or like the weapon cases. And I like these little weapon racks. But I think the Nova Armory looks a little bit better. Yeah, I think we'll I think we'll go with Nova, and I'll have to see if I can find a way to kind of. I don't mind, I don't mind this. This doesn't really bother me that much, honestly. I kind of wish that this wasn't literally in the center. But what are you gonna do, you know? Anyway, all right, guys, thank you so much for tuning into the stream. I hope you had a wonderful time. Thank you so much for all of the gift subs. It means so much to me that you guys are that you guys did that. Like seriously, 85 gift subs. Holy crap, dudes. Um Anyway, like I said, thank you all for tuning into the stream. I hope you had a really fun time. And uh I will I A gifted subscription. How generous. A gifted subscription. How generous. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you on the next stream. Goodbye. 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 Go away. Leave. You can leave now. Goodbye. Space.